All right, so your boy made a purchase, all right? I'm coming a little different with this channel, you know? I wanted a camera that was a little bit more discreet. I wanted a camera that gave off a nice, like, vintage vibe, you know, to fit in with the aesthetic that I'm already trying to go for, you know? So your boy decided to reach into his pockets. Wasn't much in there, you know what I'm saying? I'm not a little baby now, you know? We're not four pockets full. We barely one and a half, you know? Barely. On a good day. Like Friday. Payday. Who cares? Your boy digging into his pockets and he said, hmm, you know, last year, your boy had a camcorder, never put it to use. Long story short, he acted on it, camera broke. But I said, I was looking back at old footage and I realized that would make great camera footage for everyday videos, everyday little vlogs and stuff like that. So your man's decided to cop the same camcorder that he acted on just a year ago. You know what I'm saying? I'm bringing a different aesthetic, different vibe to this channel. You know what I'm saying? Y'all rocking with it? Are y'all rocking with it? I'm rocking with it. You know what I'm saying? I don't give a fuck if y'all not rocking with it. But I'm rocking with it. All right? So this is how we coming. You address... I'm moving differently. You address me differently. All right? Before it was Ferg. Now it's Ferg. Capital F. All right? Simple. Now for real? On a real note, we keeping it simple. You know, I'm about to get dressed. Take the camcorder with me. Get some footage. We're going thrifting. You know what I'm saying? The camera's more discreet, so maybe I could get more footage at the thrift store. You know, the vibes is going to be immaculate. You know what I'm saying? Who doesn't like a good camcorder vlog? You know? So we're going to be thrifting. All right? So I'm heading to the thrift store, but I don't really got my fit planned out. But there's always one piece I can rely on. That's a little faithful right here. If you know me, you know I've been rocking George all summer. But I want to switch it up a little bit and rock these, like, off-white, beige, uh cargo shorts that I copped not too long ago. I am feeling a bit lazy today. I would have thrown on some loafers to keep the fit just a little bit more classy, you know what I'm saying? So I look like one of them like artsy type niggas, but you know, I'm feeling lazy as well. So don't know how I feel about the fit, but it's the fit. It's too late to change. So I'm out. All right, I'm gonna see you. Off to the thrifty we go. Look, your man's is here at the thrift store, but it's raining like a mug. Not the smartest idea to th bring out these shorts, you know what I'm saying, the slides, but uh, we're gonna make it work, though. We're gonna make it work, though. We here at the infamous. We at the infamous, hold on. We here at the, we here at the infamous second ad thrift store. You know what I'm saying? This is probably one of the two stores that I casually go to for thrifting, you know? Not my favorite, but I try. That's what I really came here for, for some vests. But I don't have any leather vest here. I might have to try at the other thrift store. Damn, that shit's ass, bro. Damn. I might as well come. I'm leaving here with something. I don't know what, but I'm leaving here with something. The way I usually go thrifting, I just... Through, see whatever sticks out. Uh, you know, these places have been crazy disappointing lately. This is men's? This can't be men's. I want something that's gonna stick out though. Like, I need some green or brown. You know, not that brown. It's really just the process of me thrifting. Hopefully, I land on something. This feels like these Dickies pants. But not the dickies. Bro, nothing brown, bro? Like, yo, you crazy? Are you serious, dude? Thrift stores really cater to heavier set men because, you know, nobody can really fit their stuff. These polo blue shorts are kind of, kind of jacking them. Size 40, like I said. Caters to big men. Them niggas ain't have nothing in there, bro. Damn. On to the next thrift, bro. I ain't want to drive out that far, but, you know, I ain't leaving here. I, like I said, I ain't leaving out here with nothing, bro. I'm leaving here with something. So we're going on to the next thrift. Now, look, we at the second thrift store, but I know these heads, you know. I've been going here for a couple years now, you know what I'm saying? I've been going here since high school, and they're very stingy about recording on the inside. I don't know why. You know what I'm saying? Maybe they got some weird practices going on, you know, but I feel like bringing more recognition to a thrift store is what you would want. I don't know, gang. I'm not the, I'm not the, I'm not the thrift store, um, the thrift store bandit or whatever. So I can't really get footage for you boys, but I'm gonna do my best to find something. You know what I'm saying? 
Uh, I gotta really get my finger out the camera. I really gotta do my best to find something for you boys, cause you know, this is what the video's about. Copping some thrifted pieces and making a fit out of it. Can't really do that if I'm not copping any thrifted pieces. You know, if this don't work out, I'll just find some of my old pieces and use that. You know what I'm saying? Um, yeah. We'll, we'll improvise, we'll make it work. All right, I'm gonna uh, I'm gonna go see what they got. The second, third story, they didn't have much, you know, so I had to, I had to settle for something, you know. Um, this is what I had to settle for. You know, it's not much. It's definitely not my size, but you know, if anyone who's into fashion knows, one thing that we're good at doing is making it work. So we're gonna make it work. We're gonna style two outfits based around these cargo shorts and see where it takes us. All right, let's get into it. Well, I'm really rocking with the fit, you know. I think longer shorts, you know, I hated them as kids, you know what I'm saying? I'm like, why are my shorts so long, you know? I wanted them to go, you know, just above my knees, you know what I'm saying? But I think these longer shorts are really the move. Like, I think I'm really, I think I low-key found like a hidden gem because these joints low-key hitting. I'm not going to lie, the longer shorts, you know, I just got to invest in more belts, you know? It took me like 30 minutes to find a belt. But, you know, the quarter zip, you know, we keeping it calm with the quarter zip, the... Longer shorts, you know what I'm saying? The nice little slides. We keeping the comp today. I like this first fit real quick. You know, I might have to flip up in this one real quick after this video, but yeah, this is the first fit, you know? It's calm, you know what I'm saying? One of those fits where you can just go walking on the beach late at night with your girl and you start pouring out your heart to her under the moonlight and stuff like that. Yeah, I like it. I'm, I'm jacking the fit. I'm jacking the fit. So this is outfit number one, all right? Outfit number one, we keeping the calm. All right, so this is the second outfit. You know, I like it, it's different. I haven't thrown this jacket on in like over a year, but it's different, I like it, you know what I'm saying? I don't know what it is. I guess the dark color, the way the dark navy blue goes with the green, but also the hat also contrasts with the green. You know, I don't know, I'm jacking. You know, it's different, something calm, you know. You know what I'm saying? Let me know though, let me know. Out of the two outfits that I just threw on, let me know which one you, let me know which one you rocking with. Let me know which one you rocking with. I don't know if I want the bucket hat or not. Maybe I could have gone for a different hat, different color, but I jacked the fit, you know what I'm saying? This is outfit number two. It's a calm, simple fit. You know, uh, this jacket right here, I caught from Target. This thermal, Uniqlo. And these cargo shorts, I just thrifted, you know what I'm saying? So, just to keep it calm, simple, letting you know, putting you on, you know what I'm saying? I'm not gonna gatekeep, you know? Only hating ass niggas gatekeep. So, I'm gonna put y'all on. Alright, this outfit number two. I'm not gonna lie, I am a little disappointed, you know, because it sucks. Driving out to a freaking thrift store, you know, you driving out all the way out there, you know, you trying to have some, you trying to look for some good finds, and next thing you know, they ain't got nothing. So you wasted gas and you wasted your time. You know, but that's the thing about thrifting, you know, it's a hit or miss. Lately, it's been a lot of misses, you know what I'm saying? And I might just have to go back to retail. I might just have to start finding better thrift stores, taking it back to New York or something. You know what I'm saying? Mm, New York vlogs. You know, I, I could use some of those. But um, that's really all I got for you today. Sorry for the lack of fines at the thrift store. You know what I'm saying? It was really, I had my high, I had my hopes up. You know what I'm saying? Silly me, I got my hopes up. But it is what it is. This is Ferg from when we finish. If you made it this far in the video, I appreciate you. Thank you for watching. See you.